child safety and stranger danger awareness. Don't get in a stranger's car. If a car follows you, run in the opposite direction. Wear a watch with an SOS button. Your parents or the police will receive the signal. If a stranger grabs you, attract attention any way you can. Bite, kick, scratch, and shout loudly for help. I don't know this guy. Don't get up close with strangers. Move to a safe distance within five to seven seconds after the conversation starts. Two to five meters. Hide your name and surname. On your things, only indicate one of your parents' phone numbers. Don't open the door, or don't say that no one is at home. Are any adults home? No! Don't get in the elevator with them. Don't be scared. Step in. I'm waiting for my dad. Don't go with someone who doesn't know the family password. Let's go. Your mom is waiting for you there. Password. Don't meet with people you met online. I'm Michael. I'm 10 years old. Yay! It's holiday and Ava's at home. She is dancing on her favorite song. going out for the shopping. Don't be too naughty and mommy will bring some delicious food for you. And do not let strangers come in the house. Why is that, mom? They might not be good people. They might beat you and they might also steal various things from our house. Did you understand? Oh, yes, mom. Mama is going now. Bye-bye, Mom. Hello. Who are you? My name is Lily. I'll correct you if you make any mistake. Ping me whenever you need me. Oh, yes. Someone is ringing the doorbell. Have you forgotten what mommy said? Do not let the strangers come in the house. Someone is ringing the doorbell. Select an option. Yay! Who is this? I'm Santa Claus and I've got many gifts for you. Good girl. Select an option. Open the door and receive presents. You should not disturb them. Call the neighbors in case of the emergency. Select an option. You're so wrong. See all of your toys and chocolates? Please leave me. Select an option. Open the door and receive presents. Yay! 
love to play with the toys, but as mom said not to receive gifts from the strangers. I was just joking. I'm a postman. Open the door and take the postcards of your mom. Select an option. Do not open the door. Open the door and receive the posts. No! The door is really solid. You are not able to do that. Select an option. Do not open the door. Open the door and receive the posts. Take knife, cut a hole and receive the posts. Ha ha ha. Here are your posts. Take them all. Please leave me. Select an option. Is there posts? There are five posts for you. Can you read them out loud for me, please? I will open the door only when I hear them all. You are so clever. I'm Uncle Sam, your dad's friend, and I've got many toys and chocolates for you. Select an option. Open the door and receive the chocolates. Call on the 911. You should use the number in case of emergency. Policemen might be busy helping other people. Select an option. Open the door and receive the chocolates. Call on... You're so wrong. See all of your toys and chocolates? Please leave me. Select an option. Open the door and receive the... Yay! Mommy said eating chocolate is harmful for the teeth. And when Dad comes home, I will ask about you, Uncle Sam. I've got the cupcakes for you. I only love teddy bears. Oh, I have teddy bears in almost every toy you like. Come on, let me come inside. Mommy's about to come. And she said that not to let stranger come in the house. You can wait until mom comes back. Well done. Someone is ringing the doorbell. Select an option. Have you forgotten what mommy said? Do not let the strangers come in the house. Someone is ringing the doorbell. Select an option. Ask the name before opening. Home. Hi, Mom. I have got delicious food for you, baby. Did we have any visitors? Yes, but I did not open the door because he said do not let the strangers come in the house. Good girl. Mom is going to cook for you. Play with your friends. Well done. We have done it nicely. Strangers might offer you some chocolates and presents, but in any case, you should never open the door. And do not let the stranger come inside. If they are friends of your parents, write down their names and ask your parents when they come back. Ava and Alex are going to their friend's house to wish her and celebrate her birthday. What will you gift her? That's a secret. I will gift her something that helps her with the studies. I'll gift her a dress. My sister bought it yesterday. We're getting late.
are you going? We are going to birthday party. Hey, I like that gift. Give me it now. What will you do in this situation? Give first and move away. Don't give at any condition. Congratulations! You made the correct choice. Give them the gift and avoid the dispute. Hey, take this gift! Let's go! Should we inform our parents? Do you think we should inform our parents? Inform your parents. Don't share. No, we should not tell. If we tell, they might beat us. Never mind. No, you should share everything with your parents. They will always help you to get out of any problem. Do you think we should inform our parents? No, we should not tell. If we tell, they might beat us. No, we must share this with our parents. They have no right to bully us all the time. Yes, I'm going to tell this to my mom. She will complain about this to the teacher. Oh yes, I'll also tell. Correct! You have made the right choice! When someone bullies you, you must tell to you teacher, parents, or any adult you trust to find out the solution. light turns red for pedestrian. What should we do now? Wait for the green light. Cross the road anyhow. Yeah. Smart! You have made the correct choice. You should only cross the road when there's a green light. When the other vehicles stop, then and only then, you should cross the road. careful when you are walking on an empty street. What would you do now? Clever! You've made a correct decision. If you are alone on an empty road and you find someone following you, then you should run into a shop or a market or any other crowded area and ask for help. Let's go home. Why you engage us every time? Time to go. Why do you play all the time? You're making a mistake. I'm not your daughter. Let's go home. Now. What are you doing? Please let me go. The bad guy will force you to go home and will also pretend to be your family member with bad intentions. You should defend yourself. So as soon as he grabs, you need to hug the leg as hard as you can and then lean back. You get to keep your knees up and start driving your heels into his leg. Remember, the toe should be out and drive with the heel. When he lets go, roll, roll, get up and go. Roll, get up, and run out of the place. 
Remember, your head should be off the ground so you can see where you are kicking. Drive your feet as hard as you can. If someone tries to grab you from your wrists, first thing you should do is drop on your back as quickly as you can. If the person tries to pull you, then you should quickly go into his legs right away. Hold his legs as hard as you can. Keep holding his legs strongly. When someone tries to grab your leg and starts pulling you away, then you need to wrap your feet around his feet. Hold it and hug his legs. Keep your head outside and hang on tight. He will try to pick you up, but you need to hold the leg tight and lean back. You need to run away from that place as soon as you lean back. If he tries to touch you, then you should get up and start going. So as soon as he grabs, you need to hug the leg as hard as you can and then lean back. Don't be smart. Just follow me. Sorry, you are too small to resist. Keep on thinking a way to escape. You should shout as loud as you can and make everyone listen to you. Catch other people to grab their attention. Opportunity come! Shout as loud as you can to grab everyone's attention before you are pulled. Hey, what you are doing? She is our daughter. She often lies and runs away from us because she is scared to be punished by us after going home. No, they're not my parents. Girl, be nice and don't lie. We'll not punish you. She is just a little girl. Please don't punish her. Yes, we won't punish her. Honey, let's go to our home. That's not good at all. That guy lied and everyone believed him. Now you should damage the property around you to get the attention from the maximum people. Ah! What are you doing, girl? Please help me. Please. They're not my parents. They will kidnap me. What are you saying? Everyone call police, please. Amazing! We completed the lessons with great skills. What treatment should be given to a sprained person? What to do if you are bullied? Which steps should be taken when someone tries to kidnap you? And how you should walk on the road and how to cross the road? These all situations can happen at any time, so be alert, be careful, and stay safe.